This video explains what is ingress over subscription, how ingress over subscription is handled, and the new approach introduced in Junos OS release 14.2 for handling ingress over subscription on T4000 core routers with type 5 FPCs. Ingress over subscription is a state where the transmission rate of incoming packets is much higher than the rate the packet forwarding engine and router can handle, causing important packets to be dropped. Let's take a look at the normal traffic flow between router A, router B and router C when there is no ingress over subscription. When ingress over subscription occurs at router B, some packets are dropped by router B. This happens because the packet forwarding engine of router B is programmed with fixed rules to handle ingress over subscription. Based on these rules, the packet forwarding engine of router B classifies the packets into network control and best effort classes. The packets with protocols such as routing protocols are marked as network control packets and the rest of the packets such as data and voice are marked as best effort packets. The network control packets always have higher priority than the best effort packets. Thus, fixed rules are useful when you want the higher priority network control traffic to be forwarded. The limitation of these fixed rules is that even if you want the trusted transit packets marked by router A to be forwarded by router B, router B might drop these packets. For example, during ingress over subscription at router B, if router A forwards a high priority voice packet and a low priority data packet, router B treats these packets as best effort packets. There are chances of router B forwarding the data packet and dropping the high priority voice packet. Now let's understand the new approach introduced in Junos OS release 14.2 for handling ingress over subscription on T4000 routers with type 5 FPCs. You can define a traffic class map by associating the class of service code points of the incoming packets with the traffic class such as real time, network control or best effort. The network control and real-time packets have higher priority than the best effort packets. You can also define traffic class maps for DSCP, MPLS EXP, IEEE 802.1 and IEEE 802.1 AD. Then you need to associate the traffic class map with the interface on the router. The main advantage of these user-defined traffic class maps is that during ingress over subscription, the router interface uses this user-defined traffic class map to select the packet priority. When incoming packets arrive at the router's interface during ingress over subscription, the interface uses the user-defined traffic class map to select the priority and forwards or drops the packets. In this example, the router forwards the voice packet with code points mapped to the real-time traffic class and drops the data packet with code points mapped to the best effort traffic class. This is because the real-time packets have higher priority than the best effort packets. Thus, the user-defined traffic class map can be used to select packet priority during ingress over subscription.